Hey guys, I am back with another video. It is not a makeup tutorial. Sorry, that's two in a row that aren't. We're gonna have to get over it. Um, this is a Sephora haul. Um, this is actually from the VIB sale, which was mm, kind of a while ago. But um, I'm just having a chance to film this video. And so yeah, I just wanted to show you guys what I got. I don't know if anybody likes these kind of videos, but I'm doing that. Okay, also look at these gigantic ass earrings. These are five inch hoops. The bigger the hoop, the bigger the hoop. Okay, <laughs> that is not true. Especially if my mom's watching, that is not true. Um, I just got these off Amazon because I'm obsessed, but they are definitely too big. They touch my shoulders, but whatever. Anyways, here's my score. I haven't opened any of it, so um, yeah, I'm just. I got some replenishment and then some new stuff. So I'm gonna swatch it for you. You know, do all the things also show you what samples I got because sometimes I think it's interesting to find out what people kind of like to try. So I got Velour Lashes in, oh thank you Rascal. Okay so I got Velour Lashes and these lashes are in fluff, fluff and thick. So this is what they look like. They are just really big and um, fluffy and thick so but um that's what I got. Um, and then I got a Huda Beauty liquid matte because I love Huda Beauty um, liquid lipsticks. I'm obsessed with them. I realize maybe some people think it's a fad and her shit sucks. It does not suck. It's amazing. Um, this one is called Video Star. Let's see if we can get this for you people. Mm -hmm. And we're going to swatch it. So, YouTube. Okay, so let's get my wrist on there. Look how pretty. Wow, I am the world's best swatcher for sure. And I made it huge, which I think is nice because I just want you guys to really be able to see it. Yeah, so that's that one. Um, I love it. I'm not swatching any of these on my lips today because... I mean, like, this is legit my first time looking at them, so, I don't know, get over it. So, yeah, so next up, oh my god, I got so much stuff. Next up, I got a refill of Champagne Pop by Jaclyn Hill because she is the queen of my life. I have the um, Jaclyn Hill collection from Christmas time, and it's running out, and it's so sad. So, if you've never used Champagne Pop... This is what it looks like. Oh, it's making a reflection. So it looks like it's beautiful. I'll swatch it for you if you've, I mean like, unless you live under some sort of rock, how have you not seen this? I don't know, but it's amazing. Can you see that color? I think you can. My Fitbit is in the way, just so healthy. Let's get close so you can see the highlight. Ooh, yeah, pretty. Mm -hmm. Anyways, uh, I love this stuff. Um, I love it a lot. It is amazing. So, that was the replenishment. Um, because I can't get the freaking palette anymore because it's not Christmas. That's a sample. That's, these are all samples. Awkward. Um, so then I got some refills of the Jack... Uh, Jack... Okay. So then I got some contour refills of the Kat Von D um, because I love that shit. Her, her um, highlight and contour palette is my favorite in the whole wide world. So I got some of the lighter ones and some of the darker ones in here. And now I realize after buying four of them that I should have just bought a whole new palette. But <laughs> oopsies. Anyways, so those are really cool. I'm excited to just be able to refill them and not have to worry about getting a whole, honestly getting a palette would be annoying. And then is all the rest Kat Von D? I am such a whore for Kat Von D. Oh my gosh. Okay, so I got four Everlasting Liquid Lipsticks. Let me talk about this last. Um, I got a Kat Von D Tattoo Liner. This is the best eyeliner I have ever used in my entire life on the face, ever. It's, there's nothing better than it. It doesn't exist. Um, and I say that because I have like cried in it. I have slept in it. I've done all the things in it and <laughs> that sounds inappropriate. Uh, and it stays. It's, it's seriously like, it is so amazing. Um, and the tip, you can't screw up wing liner. It's, I suck at winged eyeliner and 
it's amazing. It makes it so much easier on myself. So there you go. So I got some liquid lipsticks and I have to tell you, I don't even know which ones I got, but I'm gonna show you the tops. Can you tell I was feeling springy? These are all bright as shit. So let's try some of these. Well, we're gonna try all of them. So the first one, so the first one we're gonna try is um, Malice. This one looks like a corally red, which I'm so down with. Ooh, it's like orange. I really like it. So this is what the bottle looks like. Cute. And I'm gonna have to swatch on my right hand, which is gonna be stressful for my left hand. So this is Malice, which I like a lot. It's really good for summer. It's gonna be really bright and really pretty. I am about it. Okay, so next up we're gonna do K-Dub. Um, which I think is a cool name and it is like a bright purple and I am so glad I'm doing this right now because I was on Lime Crime's website today and they're doing almost these like these exact colors that I'm buying right now. <laughs> I already bought them from Kat Von D so I'm glad I didn't buy those. Um, so this is K-Dub. Really pretty vibrant bright purple. Oh my god that is so pretty for summer. Kind of makes me want to do like a tutorial with it. I think that I will. Okay, ooh. Okay, so next up is a go-go. A go-go is similar to Malice and then it's really fucking bright, but it's like orange. So let's look at this one. Seriously, like Lime Crime released almost these exact same colors. I'm so glad I didn't buy them. Um, so this is a go-go. You can see it is straight up orange, where this is like a orange toned red, this is orange. And I don't know how you guys feel about orange, but I love orange lipstick. I have an orange from Lime Crime, actually, speaking of them. Um, but it's a stick, it's not liquid. I also have an orange from MAC called Sushi Kiss that I love. And an orange gloss from some company a long time ago that I was really obsessed with. Okay, so this one is called Beloved, and it looks like pretty pink-ish color, again, kind of a little orange undertones in there. Can you tell what I was feeling? Very peach pinky. Okay, for my left hand, these swatches are not so bad. So this is Beloved. That looks beautiful to me. I really like that color a whole lot. Um, so why I buy so many of these, these, so I probably already have five or six of these. I love Kat Von D's formulas in everything. She can do no wrong. If you want vegan, cruelty-free makeup, all of hers is. Um, and it, it works so well. The lip, liquid lipsticks feel really good on and they last all day. Um, I love them. Huda Beauties are really good and Kat Von D's. I would say my favorite liquid lipsticks ever are going to be Anastasia's, Huda, Huda's, Huda's. How do you say it? Somebody tell me. Uh, <laughs> whatever. Anastasia's. Huda's, Huda's, and Kat Von D's. So, so now I'm gonna talk about some of the samples that I got and why I got them, because they do have a purpose. Um, so I got a mini, actually, Kat Von D uh, Lolita, I think. It's either Lolita or Lolita too. Oh no, this is Lovesick. Like I said, I trust everything that she does. If she made toilet paper, I would probably buy it. Let's be honest. Um, next up, I got something I'm really excited to try. This is Diva Curl. I've never used any of Diva Curl's products, but I've heard amazing things about them. That's embarrassing because my hair is real curly. I should have used some. Um, this one is a deep cleansing serum, sulfate-free, paraben-free, silicone-free. Um, so basically, you massage it all over, work it through mid length to end, and uh, rinse thoroughly. So then you, it's basically use it in between shampoo and conditioner. So I'm excited about that. Um, and then I got a little mini, this thing is so cute, a little mini BB cream from Dr. Jart. Um, it just has SPF in it and it has a little bit of color, so I kind of like that. That's why I got that. And then I think those were probably the, like I used points for them. Um, but then I got a couple other samples. This is the Clinique Pep Start Hydro Blur Moisturizer. Um, I love this shit so much. Um, I've tried it so many times and I just wanted some more to try, so there you go. Um, I got a dual finish powder from Lancome, and then I got a, why would I buy this? <laughs> I 
I got a moisturizer for dry skin. That's pretty unnecessary. I'll give that to one of my friends. Um, sometimes I just like pick samples and I don't even really know what I'm going to do with them. And then I don't know what this is. Oh, they put it in this big thing. They make you think it's important, but it's not. Oh, Sephora. It's just shit about perfume. I have so much perfume. Um, okay, but that is everything that I got. It was kind of a lot. Not really as much as other beauty people get, but that's because they're super rich and I'm not super. Um, but yeah, I'm excited about all my things. I'm definitely going to be doing some tutorials with these lipsticks. I'm really obsessed with them. And uh, I'm also really obsessed with these earrings, but I think I'm going to have to go an inch shorter because this is really, oh, I just made a little double chin. That's really annoying. Um, this was Kyle Long. If you like haul videos, let me know. Um, I'll probably do them once a year. Rascal. My dog is looking. Anyways, if you like haul video. Okay. If you like haul. If you, if you literally make noises, okay. So if you like haul videos, please let me know because I could do them probably once every three years because I have no money. So whenever I do, I could <laughs> I could buy a whole bunch of shit from Sephora and tell you guys what I bought. Um, yeah. So everything I bought, I kind of knew I would like, but I'm excited for just the colors and stuff. That'll be fun to try. All right, if you like these kind of videos, just let me know. Um, if you liked this one specifically, give it a like and subscribe to my channel. I'd super duper appreciate it. Thanks, guys. Bye.